Hello and welcome to a Hampic Life channel. And today what I, we're going to look at how we can transform anxiety into joy. And that sounds pretty strange. They're two very, very different emotions on one level. But on another level, they're, they do match each other because they, they're both very high energy. They can be quite erratic energy. And although we're not looking for that erratic joy, the step over from that sense of feeling nervous, anxious, quite jangly, turning that into a place of joy, we can then really bring it back into our core to help to work with that foundation of contentment and peace and ease and feelings of safety. In fact, studies have shown that when, when we ask people how, how they feel when they're nervous and how they feel when they're excited, they're very, very similar things like the heart rate going up, a feeling of energy rising, a, a sense of, of feeling quite alert. So it is pretty simple. Once we get our mind behind something and really address it in the body and allow the body to get to that feeling of safety, we, the more we work with that, it become, we get easier and easier to get to that place where we're changing how we frame something and then allowing that really powerful emotion to get deep into the energy systems. My name's Leanne Campbell. I'm a life and wellbeing coach and I specialise in somatic practices. I'm also a co-creator of A Handpicked Life and there's more about us below if you'd like to check us out. And if you enjoy this experience, then please check out our other videos on transforming emotions. There is also one that helps to transform anger into assertive action. So anger and frustration into assertive action. Enjoy the practice. Okay, so we're just going to begin. You know, often when we're feeling a bit edgy and nervous, the last thing you want to do is to bring try and get yourself into a still point. And what we try and do is, is talk ourselves out of it. So what I would suggest you do at that moment is just go with how, mimic how your body's feeling. And also it depends where, where, where you are, but this is something you can practice regardless. So when you get to that place, you can acknowledge that feeling in your body and the more familiar you are with changing it, then the easier it is to get there. So that's what a practice is all about. So right now, let your body jangle, let your body oscillate, just let your, your spine ripple, let your hands shake as well, let your knees wobble, go with it. And when you meet that energy, just breathe deeply. And we're not attaching a story now, you're just simply feeling a jangle. Okay, whether that is anxiety or it's excitement or joy, you're just experiencing a jangle in your body, your energy feeling quite high and jittery and it's absolutely fine, you just breathe into it. Let's do three more deep breaths, so breathing out, empty your body completely. Take a deep breath in, breathe out. Two more in your own time. Keep moving, keep jangling. Okay, and then after three breaths, just find, let yourself settle down, okay? And we'll do a very simple exercise, which is to release. So now there's this, this jungly feeling, just have that sense of just letting it go. And we'll breathe in, swing your arms up, make a fist, make your body tense. And as you breathe out, just with that sense of letting go, breathe in. And just keep going. We'll do three or four of these. You do a few, let's do one more. Okay, and then again, just moving. And then from here, just come to the, the back of your mat, take a nice deep breath in and just reach up and let that, the, all the tingliness just let come, turn into a feeling of expansion. So 
reaching up and then from here just gently moving side to side just opening the sides of the body and then from here bend the knees and let's just soften down relax your head completely just nod side to side back to front a yes and no and yes and no and just let your head go really heavy and then very gently just see how much your legs want to open out so when we make space in the body then we're allowing emotions to shift through us so you can bend one knee straight and the other and just wiggle around a little bit with the sense of making space through the back of the body all the way down the back as your head's forward, you're allowing the blood to come to the brain. Breathe out, let go. And then bring your fingertips to your head and just massage the scalp. Massage the scalp, comb through your, your hair. And if it's a, available and it feels good to you, just gently take the hair and tug the hair away from the scalp just to relieve relieve the scalp of any tension to get to the fascia underneath and if that's not available to you just massage deeply with your fingertips into your scalp let your scalp move a little bit keep your breath flowing as you breathe out you're letting go completely draw the belly back to the spine as you breathe in, let the belly swell, the rib cage open, the chest fill. And already just allowing the blood to come to the brain, you're allowing those feelings of, of anxiety to have a different option, to be able to be reframed. So breathe out. And then when you're ready, just let your hands Relax completely, take a deep breath in, let the belly swell, the rib cage open, breathe into the back of the heart. Just see if you can tip your sitting bones up a little bit, just to extend the back of the legs, push your heels deep into the floor. One more breath. And then as you breathe out, bend the knees, press your feet into the floor, really, really slowly, very slowly now, you've been forward for a while so let yourself roll up push the feet into the floor feel your spine just uncurl creating space in between each vertebra let yourself come all the way up let the arms come up drift up just let the head come up last and then settle down again one more time just here and then this time you're just going to trace a figure of eight on its side and as you're doing this imagine that that figure eight is happening behind the heels and then let yourself come all the way up so you're just tracing eights in the field around you forwards at the back We've got lots of crossovers going on in the body around us, come all the way up until your hands are above your head. And then just as if you want to sew the front and the back of the body, so let yourself feel really solid with these eights around you. So coming down around the head and then tipping under and just send those down with your mind all the way down to the floor. But feeling, feeling solid, secure. And then just let your hands relax down. And we'll go into breath of joy. So we're taking three breaths in, one breath out. And as you do that, the arms come forward to the side all the way up and then as you let go let the arms relax down if it's comfortable to you you can swing all the way down see what your back says to that and if it feels okay breathe in breathe in breathe in 
breathe in, or you can just throw the arms down. Breathe in. Put a smile on your face. Let that feeling of openness come into the body. We're going to do three more. Last one. Okay, and let yourself come up. And just take a moment, just notice how you feel. Close your eyes, give yourself a little wiggle. That feeling of settling in. And then standing at your back of your mat, just come up. And then as you breathe out this time, you're going to bend the knees and come all the way down. Come onto your hands and knees. And just for a moment, just let your, your spine move a little bit. The movement is really soothing in the body. Breathing deeply as you breathe out. Let go completely. Just keep snaking your spine as you breathe in. Breathe fresh life force into every cell of your body. Now from here, you're just going to settle back onto the heels and then open the legs as wide as you can. Okay, and then just come and settle down. So you're going to slide forward. Now it might be that you'd like to have some support here. If you do, you can take, put some cushions or blocks underneath you. But just let yourself settle in. Think of settling the chest in. We're opening out all the way down the inside of the legs. Let your head settle. Breathe out. And just take two full breaths here. So breathe out completely. It's a child's pose. Just let this posture just feel safe and easy. Allowing the blood to come to the forebrain again. And then just raise your head a little and take walk yourself over to one side. So as far as feels comfortable, so you can really feel an opening down one side of the body and then settle down again. So just being aware now that you haven't got your sitting bones up, let them sink down. Breathe out. Let go completely. And just take a few deep breaths in. What we're doing is we're opening, as we open out the side of the body, connecting with that the spleen energy that really helps to helps you to want to get to those feelings of joy, to be able to calm the stress response. So as you breathe deeply, feel the spaces in the ribs. Notice your body might want to rock a little bit or snake the spine again. You might want to move the head, release the neck. So really pay attention and do two more full deep breaths here, breathing out fully. And then as you breathe in, really open up to receive, let the belly swell, the rib cage open, the chest fill. And gently smile. Let a feeling of lightness come into your body. And when you finish this side, just gently come up slowly. As you slow down, you're giving the body the OK signals. Walk your way over to the other side. Again, settle. Just explore this. Does your body want to move a little? Let your face hang and also notice if you're still in that place where you're feeling a little bit jangly, you can go back. You can either sit or stand and just allow it to come out of your system to a place that it, you're ready to move through. So you're always working with your body and trusting the wisdom of it and what it wants to do. But it's feeling good for you right now. Breathe into the space, drop more into a still point and let your whole body slow down. Okay, 
But when we're anxious, everything goes tight and fast. When we're joyful, it's expanded, even though it's fast. And we want to be able to get the two and also to bring it back so there's a real contentment. That's the sense in your body. Two more full breaths here. Let yourself sink down. Let the jaw soften, let your heart open. And when you're ready, just walk yourself back to centre. And once you're in the centre, just bring your elbows back, close the knees. And I just want you to place your hands over your eyes. So have the heel of the hands just under the eyes. So your hands are also on your forehead. And as you're holding these neurovascular points over your forehead, so just let your fingers relax over onto the, the, the front of the top of the head there. And I just want you to do a few hums. So as you breathe out, so every out breath, hum, let your head just soften into your hands, let the jaw relax. Take a breath in silence. Let the jaw soften, let the shoulders relax down. Notice the space inside your body and your torso, your arms, your legs, your hands, your feet. Notice the space behind your eyes. And then just release the hands. Just roll yourself up nice and gently. Just let the sitting bones relax down onto the heels. Roll yourself up, shoulders up and back. And then just find a, a comfortable sitting position. It may be that you want to put something just underneath the sitting bones take you a little bit higher just or you can you could sit in a chair and do this just see see how it feels and all we're going to do is just gently move from one side to the other and this is just in encouraging again we're working with that spleen energy pathway that will really help you to access feelings of joy and expansion and as you, as you slowly move now, allow yourself to that fast feeling of expansion and joy. At the same time, you're grounding it in to your centre. So bring something to mind that really makes your heart sink. Keep breathing deeply and always checking in. Does this feel good for you right now? Are you ready to move to this stage or do you want to stand up and jangle a bit more? Do you want to release a bit more? Just notice how you feel. If you're really feeling that, let your face relax, allow yourself to smile. 
Just one more side to side and just find your center again. And just before we lie down, I just want you to massage your face. So just let your fingers come around, whatever feels good, massaging the jaw, the eyes, the forehead, whatever feels good, making space in there. And you can get right into the jaw there, just where those clencher muscles are. Some people like to use their, their knuckle, but get right in there and circle, let this release. I'm really inviting the vagus nerve to relax now. And that, that's a time where we can feel safe, access joy and lighter emotions. And then I'd like to just go behind the ears and just gently massage the skin behind the ears. Just move it up and down. Breathe, smile, soften your belly, open your heart. And then just bring your hands just to hold your face and just let the middle fingers just slip behind the earlobes. And bring your elbows together and we'll just take a few breaths here. Let your face relax. Keeping your focus now on those feelings of expansion and ease and joy. And release the hands and lie down. And just let yourself wobble for a moment. So let the, the legs wobble, let that ripple up the spine, head side to side, shake the hands, the feet, breathe out, let go completely. Take a deep breath in. And as you breathe out, just go to a still point. Just let your, your body go heavy. And then just bringing the, the knees up to the chest. Just gentle rock side to side. And then when you're ready, just let yourself roll all the way onto your right side. Bring your hands out in front, palms together. Breathe out completely. Then as you breathe in, lift this left arm all the way over. Take your head with you and just let yourself go into a deep twist. So find where this arm needs to go. It may be that it can find the floor and feel supported. You might want to have your palm up or palm down, see how that feels. If you're not quite reaching and you feel like your arm's hanging in the air, let it drift down or get a pillow and support yourself. You can let this hand, if it feels comfortable, just relax on top of the legs. And let's just take three full breaths here. So breathe out. And then as you breathe in, breathe joy into every cell of your body. Let your body tingle with that sense of expansive, open spaciousness in your body. Smile. When you're ready, just release Come over to the other side. Exactly the same thing. Let yourself roll all the way over to the left. Have your palms together. Breathe out. And then as you breathe in, you're lifting that right arm up. Take a moment, take your head with that arm, find where this arm is comfortable. And then you can place your hands on top of the legs and soften down. Always have that moment where your body just meets the posture. 
notice where your mind is and have that sense now of just as you breathe out let your body let go of anything that no longer serves you without any story just give it permission and then as you breathe in welcome in joy and peace so we're we're going now for that drawing all that expansion allowing it to settle in the body so it becomes more of a habit to interpret feelings of expansion and joy so when we're beginning to feel tight and anxious we can we can transform that to really feel feel that in your body now two more full breaths And then when you're ready to, you can release that. Just come onto your back, just bring the knees up for a moment. And just a gentle rock side to side. Rocking is always very soothing. And then bring yourself down into Shavasana. And just give yourself a, a wobble. Rock up your body, a little shake. And as you breathe out... So when you're ready, you can keep this going for a while if you want to, but it's a soothing rock. And then let it go when you're ready and, and feel. So the body has no instruction now. The breath has no instruction. You just soften deeply. But have that sense of taking in the good. Let this feeling settle into your habit feels just through your intention. Let it be more available to you when you ask for it. Allowing the tongue to relax on the base of the mouth, the throat to be open, the heart to be open, the belly to be soft. and let that smile come right from the soles of the feet spread up the body into every cell of your body and if you feel too you can stay here a little longer when you're ready just bring in the, the knees up and yeah, just a gentle rock just let your spine reset itself and then rolling onto your right side come over onto your hands and knees and then just turn the toes under sit back on the heels and we're going to come into a forward bend so bringing the knees up just come into that forward bend again. Just notice how that feels. It's a little bit more spacious in your body. You can walk the knees, shake the head, let it hang, lift the sitting bones, breathe out, a full deep breath in. Breathe out, bend the knees, roll yourself up. Roll the shoulders up and back. And let's just do one more breath of joy to finish off. So breathe in, breathe in, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe in, breathe in, breathe in. Two more. Last one. And then just take a moment, notice how you feel. Thank you for joining me. So check out more about us in the link below. And if you've enjoyed this experience and you'd like more, 
then check out our Transforming Anger and Frustration into Assertive Action. This is a, a series on transforming emotions. Thank you.